morning all. Um, just had a few minutes in the studio. I'm just uh, just show, uh, just oh well, let's get me words out. Just thought I'd show you quickly around again. I'm running out of space, really am. I've got, uh, as you can see, I've had to start stacking my paintings up, and I've got them, you know, all different ones, all stacked up here. Um, yep. Got lots of supplies still in. That was the painting what I did yesterday. Pretty impressed. I, I, I quite like it. Now look. I don't know whether this would... You can see by the rest of my work. But this is a large canvas. I, I didn't look at the size. I assume it's something like uh, 30 inch by 20 or... 36 by 24 something like that so I've just gave it a base coat um, and an idea came to him asleep I get a lot of ideas in my sleep um, I don't know whether it's going to work out um, but I'm preparing just in case I'm thinking about putting several of these dahlia paintings I say put I mean paint onto the one canvas in different sizes so they'll overlap with a border um, and then we'll probably have petals that will come over the border I don't know whether you understand that but that that is one idea I'm thinking about doing um, we'll see we'll see how I feel later gotta let this dry now this for this morning You can see I've also got paintings up on the top here. Um, just I haven't got the space. Um, well chuffed with this A3 printer by Epson. What we bought, uh, I say printer. It's an all-in-one. I bought it for the scanner function, um, and that enables me to um, the photos. What I take, I basically I zoom in. Um, I convert them using filters on my phone into an outline and um, as you can see I've got a whole pile of this is all my pile of stuff I work on and I then transfer that onto the canvas and uh, and then I can use them again um, if anyone wants to know about that process I think I've talked about it before but I can um, tell you more um, it's just it's it's just my own way of combining technology and painting. Um, I'm more of a painter. I'm not a drawer. I used to be a drawer, but I'm out of practice, so I cheat. Well, it's not cheating. I'm creating these lovely pieces, you know. So I've got my own method of doing it. All the masters had their methods. They used ways of transferring images onto canvas. You know, um, I see no harm in that. I know some artists will say, yeah, you know, they'll be dead against it, but not me. It's all about enjoyment and the fun of producing a piece. And uh, I like experimenting, as you can see. For instance, that piece there, that was done with a palette knife totally done with a palette knife then we've got uh, you know I've tried using different colours acrylics and um, acrylics water soluble oils and um, normal oils um, and I've also I think it was, yeah this one was the left handed one what I did so um I am pretty chuffed and I'm enjoying myself and that's the main thing. I've got lots of supplies. I like to have as many different supplies as I can because sometimes I might find, might want the urge to do something different and I'm sure at some point in my life I will be trying different things because that's the way I like to be. But while I'm enjoying the having fun 
the way I'm working on these daily studies, I'm going to continue. Okay, that's it for now. Thanks for watching.